Konnichiwa Mina. It's 1883. As we're still waiting for a truce with Peru to end soon so we can attack him. As I'm still angrily just sitting here waiting to try and hopefully attack um Brazil so I can get start getting him on our sphere. But of course, can't do that till the fucking bridge get out of our sight. It's like no matter what. Okay, got that. So pause. Oh, that's right. I forgot. Now tech. Because I'm so used to pausing when I unlock tech and stuff. I just keep doing. Now I figure out how to make it automatically do itself. I got to remember that. So I have to keep doing it myself. I think I'll do this. Actually, I think which one of these does, um... Hey, oh, yeah, here we go. We, we, I want to do this instead, because I want to get, um... Unlock gas attacks soon. That'll help out a lot. Although, I don't think we get that till 1900. That's a long time away still to get to there. Alright, so... See, the Americans are trying to get involved in Mexico again. So, get out! Alright, now, um... Haiti, too. And they're trying to catch up to us, unfortunately. Even though they're already ahead of us. Alright, oh, here we go in Peru again, but... Uh, I can't really do anything with them because I'm about to attack them. But I could still, um... Try and kick out, um... Someone else instead. Alright, let's see. Decrease the opinion. Uh, even though they're zero, the Americans are most likely going to try, so kick them out. I really wish there was some way I could find out what's their score, too, with the British and such. Well, if I want, I could just cheat and go play as the British and find out for sure. Because how on earth could they have such a humongous lead against speed against us? We're na yeah, we're neighboring countries. And, okay, the British are. We're not on the same continent, even though technically we are. And, of course, I'm sure the British will be counted as the same continent, even though they're technically not either. And we have 100% investment with them, so... Why is it taking so damn long, for God's sake? And, of course, the British keep catching us up. Just, it's just kicking our ass so much. I'm getting tired of this. Would be nice if a crisis happened. That way I can kick um, them down to size. Alright, so... Get back to fixing our relationship with Canada. Even though I'm not trying to influence them at, right now. Up, oh, looks like I can um, build some new troops as more ships get built. Build some more artillery. As the sweet sound of ships are being built. Alright, now. I think I'll time to fully fund the um, a, um, administration again as we lower tax now 10%. No one's trying in little Peru. <laughs> Alright, okay, we still got those ships being built. Oh, what's this? What do we do? Oh, we can finally turn that into a colony now. Well, how nice. Alright, do that. Even though we can't build any troops, I mean, stuff there yet because they're so underpopulated. Although, I'm sure there will be capitalists trying to do that eventually and waste a whole bunch of their time and money. Then again, I would subsidize them too if they did that. Oh, I see there's parts that don't have railroads built. Since I have no idea where that, I'll just do it right here. Expand the railroads. Hurry up and do that. Come on, get your stuff already and start building. Alright, got that one railroad built. And I see another one trying to get built up. Ah, Krakatoa blew up. I love how this one has no supplies needed and still ain't building. That doesn't make sense. Alright, nothing I can do right there. Alright, got diplomatic points, so fix our relationship with Canada again. Alright, now lower our taxes to 5%. Capitalists are taking a long time to get up and running over there. As those reactionaries, I guess... Our stuff, oh, anarcho liberals, huh? Well, unfortunately, Peru, you're gonna be taking over again very soon. And of course, still gotta figure out what I'm gonna do about Brazil since they just won't go down at all. Like, no matter what I do, I can't keep up with the British or something like that. I'm sure they threw, um. Yep, they did. They discredited us. Fucking shitty Brits. I wish there was something I could do to make it so they can't, like, we can lower them instead of, we may slow them down too. Man, ridiculous. Would be nice if maybe another power can come in too and interfere with the bridge too. As troops got built up. 
Oh yeah, speak which um build some more ironclads and build some man of wars. And yeah, build them in South America too. And speak which I'm pretty sure they finally made it. Yeah, there they go. Alright. Now we're gonna get rid of all the um man of war since they are no longer needed. Here we go. Bye bye, you're no longer needed. Alright, so now our army is fully modernized. This needs to be expanded still. Alright, lower the taxes to zero, so now we're only being funded completely on our tariff. Ain't that just something? Alright, so military statistics still got to wait till October. Two more months for that. Let's see. That railroad hasn't even been built yet? Come on, I'm getting tired of this. I wonder if I should consider maybe I'm um, switching party soon. Maybe get more encouraged capitalists. Well, you got interventionalism, which is definitely good. I do want the jingleistic. That's what definitely needs still, though. That's that is actually the real goal of the game. Twenty percent increase, and you guys give me a first. Yeah, definitely we keep. Got, they gotta be jingoistic still at least, and of course still not getting to there yet. As fucking British kicking us down again. I'm tired of this crap. I throw more diplomatic points I can as we unlock that now. No, don't decrease, increase. Alright now. Um no no, here we go, military logistics. As we got, yep, we gotta wait till 1900 still to unlock that, but as long as I'll be ready to go to unlock that in time, I'll feel a lot better to get gas attack and such. I definitely need that. At least all of our stuff are being built up, including all the railroads. I don't know why you're paused. Unless I think I may have changed it to, um, every time a new text unlocked the pause, too. We got low enough infamy, but I'm not gonna attack anyone yet. Goal still Peru and Brazil, and this time around when I attack Brazil, I'm gonna leave troops in the capital, that way something like that will never happen again. Cannot ever allow fucking um, rebels to go in and break away from our puppet. Brazil's probably too big to puppet and such. Of course, it'd be the goal to probably take territory and stuff from them. And I probably would have been able to get to the um, British, I mean, on the Brazilians quicker if I was able to civilize quicker and such too. I mean look at this! Look how fast the British are going up compared to me and I have the exact same stuff and plus the investment too. I should be going up the exact same rate if not even faster than the Brits yet they're just kicking our ass and that time there was no um, discredit in either so that wasn't the reason. That just doesn't make sense how it's going up so quickly. I think I will do that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Did you say Russia getting territory? Somewhere, unless it was a crazy... Oh, so the Dutch got that down there, huh? So I see um, Dutch got that colony right there. And of course, still, no one's trying to get Liberia and such. And con hey, I don't think I can colonize any of that. I think it's too far away. Yeah, too far away. <laughs> as pause once again. As we are now in 1884. As that will end the episode here. As this upcoming month, we'll finally be able to attack Peru. So...